What is going on guys? Welcome to Greggles TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech. How is everyone doing? Hope you're having a fantastic day. We've got a few news stories for you, no questions. I am in uh, Palm Desert right now uh, with my family, so we're hanging out there. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow though with the regular scheduled news with your questions answered as well. So without further ado, Let's get into our big tech news stories of the day. The first one is about that June update. It's been rolling out and it looks like it's being postponed due to some bugs and some issues going on with it. So here in America, it's definitely going to be postponed. How far it could be days, uh, weeks. If I had to guess, it's probably only gonna be like five to seven days more um, for the postponement. So if you don't have it yet, there's a really high probability you won't get it for a bit now, again, because of the postponement due to some bugs for people that already have it. So be patient with it and you will soon have that over two gigabyte update. Next up is about the Google Pixel Fold. Now, I wanna let you know, Google Pixel Fold, as you know, is only available on the Google Store. Well, that has changed now. You can literally pre-order it from any place you want now. You can order it from, I believe, the only store I didn't check was T-Mobile, but they have to be available, right? T-Mobile, definitely AT&T, definitely Verizon as well, and also, Amazon, I went to Amazon's page, so they're like, seems like they're still getting it up, but it is there. I'll link them all down below if you wanna pick it up from any of them. And AT&T has a really good deal with no trade-in at all. You can get it for as little as $25 a month, or if you want the 512, you can get it for $30 a month. And then Verizon also has it. You can trade in and get it for half off, basically, with a trade-in. And the release dates, though, are gonna be in July, like mid-July, basically, for the carriers. Um, mine, personally, since I got it from the Google Store, still says it's gonna be released, basically, the, the, the day it's released or a few days afterwards, uh, as of right now, but that could change as time goes on. So if you wanna pick it up, you can get some really nice offers with the carriers. Um, so keep your eyes peeled. Again, I'll link those down below. Next up is about the OnePlus V Fold. Remember, this is the folding phone from OnePlus that's coming out that's going to be looking freaking awesome. I'm really looking forward to this one. It has a huge outside display, has a huge inside display as well, up to eight, over eight inches, a little over eight inches, which is, if you compare that to something like this phone, which has 7.6 inches, it's a huge difference. It's, it's really massive. It's also supposed to have three speakers as well. So it's gonna have, and mostly these phones only have two speakers, so it's gonna have three speakers, which is gonna give it really, really good sound. It's gonna have supposedly good cameras on there. So if you want much better photos, maybe better than the Galaxy Z Fold 4, you should be getting that. It has the fingerprint sensor on the side and it's got an all aluminum body. It's really nice looking. It doesn't look that big in terms of its, you know, how fat it is or anything. It's got the Hasselblad cameras. I'm liking the look of it so far and I'm very, very interested in this phone because it has that outside display that looks like a normal phone in, in its height and its width. It just looks like a normal phone. It doesn't look anything too crazy. So this is a definite, definite eye catcher. And then usually OnePlus has their prices really, really competitive and that's the other part of it. So there's a lot to take away with this one. Release date should be somewhere between August and October. I know it's a kind of a big range, but that's when the release date should be. So keep your eyes peeled on this one. Out of all the folding phones that are coming out where you live, what's the one that seems to be the most intriguing for me, it's either the Pixel Fold or this OnePlus Fold for sure. So let me know your thoughts. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. We'll see you down the road.